best condition when wet. Can't say that about many routes, can you? And what is it today? It's pretty damn. Oh. <laughs> so the aim of the Lakeland Revival is to restore the traditional rock climbs in the Lake District that are being lost to foliage and dirt and just give the lakes a bit of love and attention. It says the main feature is a classic gully on its left. Definitely a feature, a water feature. Sergeant's Crag Gully, a classic of the grade, climbed in, I think it was the 1800s. They had the eye for a line back then, I can tell you that. running with water so it's like a wall with a layer of moss and then a layer of water <laughs> and then loads of drips it's very involved it's quite organic I'm not sure how to do this next but not like any of the problems down the wall die now onto this, but it's going to be the only way to... You know it's good when it's like really top-notch stuff. Brilliant, that's a piece of rock climbing history above us. Climbers should have a good, robust sense of humour, and if that route doesn't bring out a pretty strong, you know, sense of humour in you um, as towards what you're doing, then I don't know what will really. <laughs> Do I encourage people to get out there and do more routes in the lakes? Yes, because I'm guilty of not having climbed in the lakes as much as I should. But every time I go there, maybe not necessarily with Sergeant's Crag Gully, but I'm blown away by the rock quality. It is the sort of finest quality mountain rock you get. That's not penny falling. This is just my action position. <laughs> it strengthened our relationship. It's basically a total, you know, path of clean rock now that we've done with it. There was an insurmountable amount of vegetation on that route. <laughs>